The statement in the Daily Nation of 4th August 2011, page 9, attributed to the CIC chairman, that the requirement that Kenya's first ever controller of budget and first auditor general under the Constitution be a member of a professional body of accountants recognized by law is discriminatory and unconstitutional is surprising and unexpected. We wish to reiterate that the minimum qualifications required of the two offices which are recognized in the Constitution as independent offices which include among others the requirement to hold a bachelor's degree in accounting, finance, or economics, as well as membership in a professional body of accountants recognized by law, are neither unconstitutional nor discriminatory. We clarify that ISPAC is the only professional body of accountants recognized by law in Kenya having been established by the Accountants Act in 1978. In selection of leaders and public officers, we must be guided by the principle that selection must be on the basis of, among others, competence and suitability. Another key guiding principle is the expectation of accountability to public for decisions and actions. This principle is premised on the basis that the holders of these offices, including the controller of budget and auditor general, have the requisite qualifications, skills, and competence to make decisions and take the actions expected of them and to accordingly account for them. At the heart of the Constitution of Kenya, is the entrenchment of the principles of good governance and accountability. The Constitution sought to entrench these principles through the creation of strong institutions with mandates to safeguard accountability. These institutions are required to have appropriate structures, systems, and more importantly, the right leadership to deliver on the principles of good governance. In implementing the Constitution, it is good to follow the letter of the provisions contained in the Constitution. But it is more important to adhere and indeed uphold the spirit and the totality of the Constitution. ISPAC believes that the Independent Officers Act in prescribing the qualifications skills and competence of the holders of the offices of the controller of budget and auditor general was in keeping with both the spirit and the letter of the constitution, ensuring that persons selected for the two offices are fit to protect and serve in public interest.